Hey y'all, Mr. Sunglasses here, back again for some more NES action. It's time for another Adventure Island because there were three of them. So, I got my cart in the top corner. Hello, Adventure Island. I've got my sunglasses of beauty and joy. And my NES controller of accuracy and reproduction. Uh, side note, this retro link controller is pretty accurate. It doesn't feel quite as heavy as the original NES, but what are you going to do? Parts are cheaper and easier and lighter to make. Anyhow, Adventure Island 3. In the U.S., it was released less than a year after Adventure Island 2. My guy's got a girl now, and she got kidnapped by aliens. Does it hold up to the same system of power and joy? Is it better? Is it worse? Let's find out, shall we? There I am, chilling out with my girl. Holy crap, my bikini babe, son of a bitch. Let's go, dino buddy. Music's about the same as two. Inventory system again. Graphics, fairly comparable the same to the, uh, the second one. Probably the reason they were able to release them so quickly back to back was, uh, a few minor tweaks, but generally the same game engine and same same game graphics. Ah, J skateboard looks different. Um, just like in one, you cannot go backwards again. They got rid of the ability to go backwards. I don't know why. Uh, it's kind of a step back in my direction, but I guess it's it's still got floating spiders. I guess maybe the actually now that I look, especially some of the enemies do look a little bit more cleaned up graphics wise. Their sprites are a little cleaner. But uh, as far as going backwards, I guess maybe it's part of the difficulty of, oh, I missed it. You can't go back. Always moving forward, right? Fruit keeps that time up. Ooh, new weapon. Earlier on. So that's cool. There are new weapons in the other ones too, but you don't get them until way later in the game normally. You can duck. So. There you go. New weapons earlier. Whoa. Oops. And ducking. But boomerangs, you can only throw one boomerang out at a time. Important to note. Ah, when I pick up the boomerang, the axe went into storage. That's very handy. Nope, you can't pick between them. Boomerang, like I said, is tough because if you miss, you have to wait. You don't get it. Ah, break the Come here, dino friend. You don't get a uh, second chance with uh, the boomerang like you do with the axe. I don't like his spit. <laughs> Sorry, itchy nose. Oh, that beautiful, beautiful points. Yeah, the boomerangs are a longer range, but I want that second chance, baby. Move it, move it, move it, I'm invincible! Move it, move it, move it, uh. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I caught myself on fire. I should be alright. The fairy doesn't have any real animations. That's unfortunate. I like for the fairy to maybe like flop a little bit or something or be sparkly, but can't have everything. Overall, the animation in the game is really solid. 
Alright, what can this guy do? Okay. He can roll until I- Whoa, hey, 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 coming from the back there now, buddy. Now that's just rude. Very rude monsters charge you from the back in a side scroll like this. Because you're like, well, where did he come from? I was just there. Oh, I ran across the ocean and now I'm in the ocean or something. Uh huh. Swimmysaurus Rex. Just for the controls, like, oh yeah, I was gonna say, I gotta see that, uh, if you don't have the dinosaur, this level is gonna be pain and slow, but luckily I'm almost done. Yeah! Mm. Alright, out of the water. Okay, cool kid pig. Uh, sorry. That's a tough area to have a skateboard in. That crab pinched me right directly in the ass. Uh. Jump over the cool pig. Jump over the cool pig. Kill this crab pinching my ass. It's a cheeky crab. Is that a... Octopus, yeah. It's Octorox! Link! Hmm. Well, there you go. Adventure Island 3, does it live up to the other two? Yeah. It's pretty good. Uh, again, solid controls. Feels responsive. I never felt like I was fighting the controls. Hit detection is great. Neat enemies. Colorful graphics. Music that, that comes along pretty good. It kind of changes it up. Different stages. You got underwater. You got caves. You got different dinosaurs to ride. Adventure Island. Hudson did it right with these. These that that little bee made some good games here. And uh, what can I say? They were good. I liked them. They were all uh, fun. And until next time, uh, I'm Mr. Sunglasses. When we're gonna be looking at some not so good adventure games. Unfortunately, there are some other adventures of games coming up that. Just not as good as Adventure Island. But you'll see. Until then, stay cool.